Meja Somnath Sharma The enemy is only 50 yards from us we are heavily outnumbered we are under devastating fire i shall not withdraw an inch but will fight to the last man and the last round meja somnath sharma among those uncountable brave soldiers who have given their lives during the indo pakistan war in 1947 there was a man who did something so extraordinary and proved the true meaning of leadership From the very beginning of his career in the Indian Army, Meja Somnath Sharma was known for his praiseworthy work. When Pakistan invaded Jammu and Kashmir on October 22, 1947, he was serving as major in 4th Kumaon Regiment. Next morning he received the orders to report in Srinagar with his troop. Before his company was asked to move to Srinagar, he had an accident while playing hockey and his hand was fractured. He was advised to rest but he insisted to be with his company. 2 days later they were given the information that the enemy soldiers have captured a small town named Badgam which was only a few miles away from the Srinagar airfield. They had entered into the valley with only one intention to seize Jammu and Kashmir under their possession. Clear cut orders were given to Major Somnath and his company to prevent any intrusion and defend the new state that has become the part of India. When Major Somnath and his soldiers reached their destination on the 3rd of November he made sure that all his troop members were at the fighting positions according to his strategy. He knew that the enemy has attacked Badgam to distract them and the next attack would surely come from the west. During the patrolling they did not notice any movement of the enemies so two companies were moved back to Srinagar. Only the D company led by Major Sharma was asked to stay back. Around 3 p.m. a large army force of nearly 600 to 700 enemy soldiers appeared from the west and started firing. They attacked the company with powerful mortars. Within a few minutes, they were surrounded by the enemy who was firing at them non-stop. More than 50 Indian soldiers were dead and the company was inflicted with major loss due to heavy bombardment. Major Somnath analyzed the whole situation and soon understood its gravity and the danger they were in. He knew that if the enemy succeeded in their mission and took control over the Srinagar airlift then soon they would lose everything but he wasn't ready to take a single step back even though they were outnumbered. He ran to his ground section often exposing himself to the enemy without caring for his own life and encouraged his troop members to fight till their last breath and motivated them not to give up. Even though his right hand was fractured he ignored all the outcomes and took the responsibility of filing the magazines and supplied them to men who were operating light machine guns In between the firing a mortar shell exploded near him and killed him But under his leadership the Indian soldiers were so much motivated by his valor and determination that they fought the enemies for 6 hours After some time the reinforcement team landed at the airport and took control over the situation It was Major Sharma's courage and unbreakable spirit of soldiers of 4th Kumaon Regiment that the deadly intentions of the enemies failed. For his fearless actions, he was awarded Param Veer Chakra PVC India's highest wartime gallantry award. He was the first recipient to receive this award.